fellow comrades, Kamisar Bro here today with Making History Gold playing as Germany. That's right. Um, if last you guys remem remember, we were liberating Africa from the clench of what's left of the British Empire, pretty much. It's, yeah, it's like it's the whole thing, man. It's what we were doing. That is what we would do, and, and we're just gonna come up in here and just lay down the lay down the beaten and take what we need and take what we can as quickly as we can, if possible, if at all possible. All right, and we're actually gonna we're taking back some of these areas for our Italian ally, who has been stuck with it. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna need more troops. I'm going to bring down the 66th. And I'm considering I'm going to war with Egypt. Because they're, uh, basically, they're in our way. You know? See that? And, like, the British have military access with them. So, they can just continue to walk through our lands like it's nothing. By the way, I forgot about Danzig, and now it's a 100 <laughs> IPU city. I didn't even realize it until I was uh, going down the city list. Just making sure everything was basically efficient enough. And then I saw that and I'm like, what? That's ridiculous. Completely ridiculous. But, uh, yeah, so. Well, now we have a super uh, industrialized port city. Um, so we can actually build, like, see that? We can build fast battleships and stuff out of it in six turns. Um, so, that, yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> Uh, I'm I'm not too sad about that, and um, we've been continuing building uh, fast battleships over there in Kiel, so our fleet continues to get larger. I'm actually going to mobilize the fifth fleet to clear out the North Sea there. Um, wah, 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 wah. Actually, I'm going to mobilize the Eastern fleet as well to go down there and deal with that little problem. We can't have the British floating around in our waters now, can we? No, we cannot. We must bring them down. Give them no quarter. And all that good stuff. You know what? I'm going to split up. The 83rd is going to go north to deal with the British. Oh, shit. And I'm going to send down the 66th to deal with the British and South Africans. Yeah, there we go. The Gulf of Gabes. Oh, see, I lost one of my cruisers. My poor little cruiser. They sunk it. This boss said she sunk it. Whatever. <laughs> we didn't need it that bad. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to station a fleet right here to make sure that they uh, they can't use the Suez Canal anymore uh, to get back and forth. Um, what else do I need to do? There's really not too much else to do. But, you know, I was looking at the industrialization of the Soviet Union. They've industrialized very well. Like, I don't know where their army is because it's no longer on the borders. But, uh, oh, and Japan's been pushed all the way back. Huh, interesting. I might actually have to go over there and help Japan. I didn't realize they were doing so poorly in their war effort. Hmm. Sometimes you just can't pay for good allies. Hmm. Well, what I could do is I'm going to send this over. The 77th, get them mobilized. Have I, has this surrendered to me yet? Oh, no, it hasn't. All right. Um, over to the North Sea. All right, and we're going to get these guys to escort the 77th all the way around to Asia, to China. Actually, you know what? We could invade through India and bring India down. Let's do that. Yeah. Who needs to help the, uh... Oh, and let the Italians just capture the Suez Canal Zone. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Wait, go Italy. Way to go Italy. Uh, but now we're getting... The British are attacking back in Libya. Move forth! Quickly! So, this is what happens a lot, uh, in the game. Is, uh... As the fighting tends to wear down, this kind of stuff happens, like this uh, this land grabbing <laughs> that's currently going on. But, um, I don't know. I think we're doing really well. 
I feel pretty positive about this. We've pretty much liberated Africa for France, although we are not they're not really our allies and we're not really into the business of saving them or anything. You know, oh look, the Canadians are helping the Chinese. But um, you know, they they I don't know. I, I guess it, it doesn't really matter too much. At least the British don't have it as far as I'm concerned. Drop drop in Baluchistan. Bam, look at that. Yeah, all right, I'll accept that. I don't mind. Egypt just is just a thorn in our side anyway. Oh shit. We missed the we missed that little blot there of Uganda. Damn Alright, drop one. Go back. Go back and concrete, man. Alright, good. Alright, so we're gonna go to Nyesland first and then northern Rhodesia. Into Rhodesia, men. Egypt has joined the Chinese alliance. That's how you know the British have been beat so bad. Is their alliance isn't their British alliance or the allies. It's the freaking Chinese alliance. <laughs> oh, that's your only hope, England. China. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is going to be hard to conquer. Just because there's so much land. Oh, shit. And they've actually got men here. Ooh, that might be a, a problem. Oh, wow. Look at that. We just lost, like, half of our army there in northern Rhodesia. The South Africans just had a bunch of cannon fodder to stop us. Oh, Jesus. Oh, now our army's cut off. Well, that's no damn good at all, is it? Damn! Damn you to hell! All right, and I'm going to start conquering some of Egypt there so that we can get Italy to control that. Yes, create a fascist India. Sweet! Oh, wow. Well, a lot of stuff's going on in this, uh, this game. Okay, so... Mm, 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 mm. That was a little bit more costly than I would have liked. Whatever. Onward. To glory! Did we go to war with these guys? No, we didn't. We're not at war with Belgium. Alright. Uh, Transvaal. Boom shakalaka. Um... God, there's just so much little tiny bits and pieces. Little bits and bubbles. You've got to take over. Bits and bubbles. Wait, is there a fleet down here? Uh, you know what I can do? I can actually move this fleet here. Over here. And then I'll take these guys. And I'll drop them on Madagascar to cap that too. And look at India. Yes, yes. It's becoming a brand new country. Yes, exactly like we would want. And the British. <laughs> the poor British. They can't handle it. Boom, look, India just made its first uh, group of soldiers. And. Yeah, we're kicking ass, man. This is great. We are just kicking ass and taking names. And then Southwest Africa. Bam, we've. Pretty much taken Africa. Now we just need to hit that. Um, let's see. That should be. And once we take that over, um, whatchamacallit should surrender. South Africa. Well, now I've got to take back Transvaal. Damn it. Damn you. Monkey. Monkey, monkey. Uh, let's see. What else do we need to do? Okay, so basically, I'm thinking once we conquer all of India, we'll pretty much call it a day. Damn. Look at that. Look at that. This was a 13 division tank army at first. See, this is kind of why I like to use tanks predominantly. Um, look at that. South Africa surrendered. This is now part of Germany, ladies and gentlemen. Hell yeah. All right. That is what I'm talking about. Yeah. Keeping daddy happy. All right. And then we're going to go over there to South Shells, State Shells, and then there. Why isn't Italy kicking their ass? Come on now. Take these guys over. We 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 we, we got to beat them, man. <laughs> they're like they're just sitting here like tiptoeing around them. Sweet, we got medium bombers. Awesome. All right. So, uh how much more do we have? Well, we still got a decent bit. All right. Well, Push on, push on. See, the British Empire is always the hardest to kill in this game, just because they have so much land. 
Like, you pretty much just got island hop, sort of like in Super Power 2, how you've got almost island hop, just to conquer everything. And it looks like our armies killed each other. Well. But the Indians are moving in on the western front of China, who is not ready for this ish, or are they? Well, they got a pretty big army. I'm not going to say that they're, they're going to lose it. But, uh, and we almost beat the British. The British managed to finally halt our advance and Bengal, so, yeah, that happened. <laughs> and the Japanese are still attacking the Chinese from the east. So China is surrounded on three fronts, and uh, we'll probably bring in some reinforcements from somewhere. I think I need to make England surrender to us, because they are, they just, too brave. Too, too, too much of a problem. Oh shit, Canada took back Scotland! Oh crap! <laughs> oh, well that makes for an interesting story. Alright, so, well this has been Commissar Bro, thank you so much for watching. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and call this one to an end for today. And I hope you've enjoyed it, I know I have. And I will see you guys next time.